Hello my dear children, how are you all? I hope you all are staying great and staying fit. So we are watching television, we are listening music, right? So I am here and you are there sitting me with your phone, right? So you can see the live also, right? So there are many other things that have changed, right? Why I'm talking about this today? Because so we see the improvement in many things, right? So from the Kacha Road to Pakka Road, from Kacha House to Pakka House, right? So from uh, Pakka House to buildings, apartments. So these are the things what they have improved, right? So the facilities, so what we are requiring, right? So what we are required for the daily life that have been changing day by day, right? So that only we are going to learn for the today's class about what our chapter 22 facility improvement, right? So we have seen many changes. When we are small, we never know what about the mobile. But presently we know what about, what is mobile. So we don't know what is laptop. We don't know what is uh, washing machine. We don't know what is iron machine. We don't know what, uh, television. So we don't know many things. But nowadays everything has been changed, right? They improve a lot. It's because of what? The technology that we are adapting right so there are many other things that have been changing right so it's about what facility so facilities means what whatever we need which are important which is which are required right so when we are want to talk with some other person emergence right so what we will do we just dial a number we'll call that person right so we can reach the person anywhere, right? So that is what improvements. So before that, when I was in class 7, right? So my relatives are in other country, right? So what I have to do? I have to call the uh, uh, telephone uh, booth. Uh, telephone, there are so many telephone booths. There is a section we have to call the person in a telephone exchange they used to connect in that other country but now sitting in at home we can connect anywhere right so that is what improvement whether it's a good or bad so we can take things some are good Right? So watching the whole day TV or mobile is it good thing? No. So we should use that improvement for the good thing not for the bad thing. Right? So that only we are going to learn. Right? So here not only these in technology the roads is only mud. There is no other way. The you, people used to walk there then they used to make ways in that time. But now there is a highway, there is a uh, good roads, right? So in the traveling, they used to, people used to walk by, they used to walk. If they want to travel somewhere, they used to walk, right? There is no vehicle available in that time. But now we have reached where? To the air also, right? So and the houses. There is no house, the people used to uh, stay in forest, they don't have any uh, particular house they used to make, uh, uh, they lives in cave to protect them, right. So but now the, uh, what everything has been changed into apartment, right. So in a big buildings, right. So this is what improvement, water. 
right. So, uh, for a human what is essential? Food, water, right. So, air, right. So, in a food, if you see the people don't know how to eat the food, right. They used to eat the raw, some of the uh, things they used to eat, what the available, the uh, natural sources are there. We are getting all the fruits, vegetables in that time also, but don't know how to eat them, right? Say so, so the improvement of in food chain also. So we are eating many things in these days, right? In that years ago, they don't know about food feeding, right? And about the water, we'll get from the well now. Uh, in that time. We are getting from the well. They used to dig and they get water from there. There is no resource from a resource of water, right? So, but now many things have changed, right? So, there is a fresh air in that time because there is only trees in the in the years ago because there is no building, right? There is no vehicles. So, there is no uh, air pollution. That is why they are getting good air, fresh air. But now, we are not getting, they are, now we are, we are having fan, air condition, air cooler, right. But we are not getting fresh air, right. So, some improvement have for a good thing, but some have not good, right. So, here that only we will see, let us see the chapter ok chapter 22 facility improvement ok with the explain with the example how natural resources resources and creativity of a man changed the lifestyle of a man right so everything has been changed from cloth from food from water from air from other facilities from vehicles right so there are many other things have been changed right so if you if you see the last two uh, last five to six years the people used to wash clothes right so they don't know about washing machine but after inventing washing machine people using it they don't know yes it will be in future we may get the uh, what washing machine they don't even think of that but the technology have been changing right so here color the things in the picture which are very essential for you to live right so we need many things but some are very essential right so some are very essential like what fruits right fruit here uh, bat ball, telephone, cloth, bangles, house, car, right, and radio. So, in these, right, so they, you can see there is a many improvement in this, but the things we are not, which are not essential, right, without washing machine, we can wash the cloth, right. So, the things which is not necessary. Right, but the things which are essential for our life, these are like fruits, which is food we want, right? Without cricket, we can live, right? So without telephone, we can live, right? With without cloth, we can we live? No, we can live, but which is which is essential? Cloth is essential for us, right? Even bangles, not necessary, right? Without that, we can. It will be fine with us. House, yes, it's a need, it's a shelter, right? So, we, it is very essential for us. So, and car and radio, without them we can live and which is not even essential. But food, as we learn in previous classes, food is necessary, shelter is necessary, even clothes is very necessary for us to protect us, right? So, these are very essential for a life, okay? So, here see the next one, observe the following pictures, 
find out the difference between the necessary things used by the human being in you know, a olden days and now right so there is as i said there is a many other improvement right it have been changing still it's changing we are getting more varieties right in a, uh, one product only we are getting more improved technology or improved one we are getting right so here day by day there is a many improvements we can see right so see here i'll just show you the pictures nowadays also in a small village they are doing the same thing right so with a, a stick they used to cook with fire right so here uh, there is no stoves in it right? so they use stoves right so here nowadays what we are using we rarely see these right in a village only we can see them but here gas right so we are using these right so we are getting very easily these availability of uh, gases are more now so we are getting these so here what is that it's a pot right so there is a mud pot where people used to store water for every day essential when a uh, what for anything so uh, for water essential they use pot to save the water here now we are there are tank right so here we can see this is what it's like a mixture only but with the stone right they used to grind it but here we are getting a grinder mixer grinder right so it's like it's a machine now see the next one so farmer right for the farmer also they used to get the water from the well and he used to uh, what uh, watering the plants but now there is a motor for that right it pumps the water and it flow to the all the field right now see what is this so people also use these like a fans right so with the papers right so but now we are getting fan air cooler air conditioned right so here there is many things which have been improved right from uh, using from the stick and fire and they use only mud pots but now we are getting stoves right gas cylinder we are getting from the mud pot to tank to to, uh, to store the water and uh, from grinder right rubbukallu we used to say rubbukallu right so from there to mixer right so from farmer uh, he used to get water from the well and he used to supply the all the fields but now he use pump water pump from uh, this fan to handmade fan to fan right so there are many other improvement we can see okay match the following as the model given okay so here see notes farmer used to use plow and all but now he is using tractor to do the same if you see uh, in field right for the tractor only they have uh, it attached with the plow where it dig the mud right so here it's like a man work here the machine work that difference only we can see right so he used to work for the whole day plowing the thing plowing the uh, field but now after coming the machines he using those uh, vehicles right so from so you have to match with this okay now see the first one he is writing from the uh, feather whether it's peacock whether it's uh, any uh, feather okay where a bird feather pigeon stuff they used to dip in ink and they used to write if they want to send the letter to any other they used to write 
with the that feather but now uh, feather tip okay but now we are using pens right we are getting more pen many color pen right so here that difference we can see see the next one letter post letter we used to post a letter if you want to send any message to other person or other place so we used to write the post letters and we have to put the stamps and we have to write the address but now how we are sending through whatsapp right so we use facebook and many other technology have been changed right so if you want to send the message we just send through the mobile or the computer right so here so from post letters to the computer now see the next one uh, sarees they used to make a sarees with handmade so we already uh, know about the occupation waver right so he waves the uh, what silk or cotton uh, through his hand but now they you for that only there is handmade work but now we are getting uh, what machines for that for that we are nowadays the handmaids are very rarely we are not getting those handmade clothes so we are giving more amount to the waiver right because the handmade work is what very worth very nice right so it's perfect right he used to work so so hard that we are paying more for that right so for the for a machines there it's take very less time but it will work more we are getting more pieces right so here see the this one before watching there is no don't know how to see the time there is no timing for that but uh, by the seeing the sun right so if he is arising he just, just people assume this is like 9 o'clock if the sun is middle of the uh, sky right so it's like a 12 o'clock if he comes down means it's like a 4 5 6 and people used to assume by seeing the sun right so but and with the uh, time right so they use uh, this one where the sun used to Well, there is about one minute or if the, if depends on the size, but now we are getting clock, right? So, and yes, before that we uh, people use animals. We still uh, people still using animals, but nowadays uh, years ago there is no other vehicles. That time they don't have any options where people use animals like cow. right so horse bullock carts horse cart right to carry the goods but now they use truck right so to carry the goods the people use truck house as i said see the houses these are called kachcha house it with a uh, straw right so with the mud people used to uh, stay in that only with the mud and the Uh, straws but now these are now it turn into apartment or the building or the individual houses from the pot mud pot to steel pot we are using we rarely get uh, what mud pots so we use is only right so here see the next one know this with the help of science and technology man has learned to use many natural resources for example machines vessels mud, uh, vessel metals uh, metals used to construct the house and use of petrol diesel you know tractor lorries buses water pumps etc manufacture of paper by using the wood pulp 
etc right so with the help of science and technology right so man has learned how from uh, he used to live in a small cave so he do he want the animals were start attack so he wanted to protect himself so he start using the doors if there is no light so he started using uh, he started making windows like that he start inventing the same way in the technology right so from uh, telephone to cell phone right now mobiles so there is a long journey where a people has started uh, inventing by using technology right so from like machines vessels metal used to construct a house so use a petrol of petrol or diesel in a tractor lorries buses water pumps etc right so we need diesel or a petrol to uh, do any work right so electronic work so like lorries need buses water pumps they need petrol or diesel manufacture of paper by using the wood pulp right so by the wood pulp the whatever you see the outside layer they used to take out and they will recycle it and they use it as they will use as uh, papers right with this by using their creativity they learn to prepare different kinds of machinery clothes vessels paper are and different kinds of product in this way people are changing their life to be easy by using natural resource and their creativity right so how much have improved people know how to use this right so people start using those right so people are uh, using those machines right so if they are available easily so they are using that okay so do it yourself right so there is a small exercise so with the help of your elders make a different model with a clay clay means mud you can make so when we are child we used to make all the kitchen things with the mud right so like that like brinjal a pot uh, what banana butterfly so you can make with the mud right so here with the help of your elders prepare the models you know by using different grains beads color papers pieces of clothes and stick here okay so whatever the available of these materials like grains right so we can uh, stick right so we have we can uh, draw flowers and we can stick some grains to that and and we can color it right so with the beads with the paper you can draw butterfly you can stick many other uh, colors to that right so it will be more attractive okay now other activity draw the picture of different types of pots you have seen suggest where we can use them right your suggestion below the picture right so we can see many kinds of pot whether it's in this shape right so we can see many other shapes right like this okay so some are like this so everybody so the width is same sometimes you can see like this so so these are the some parts we can see some of those right do you know this it is said that charles babbage so charles babbage as you know he invented the computer right so here it is said that charles babbage a british mathematician he is the great mathematician made the first computer in 1837 right so in the 1837 where the available of what machines so he prepared computer when 9 1837 
so many people called him the father of computer metals are hard and glittering we can give different shapes to them it, it is very easy to clean them it is not an expression to say that there is no work without metals right so we can see everywhere if you if we want to build the house we need metal right so if you see the table right it's made with metal right in a computer there is a metal in that so you can, we can say everywhere we use these metals right so we can give when uh, we can give any shape of this any shape for this right so and it is very easy to clean also it is said that the statue of liberty in america is made of 350000 kg of copper right so uh, statue of liberty you may you have seen a lady standing with a fire lamp right so she is the uh, it's made by copper about 350000 kg the use of mud pots of for cooking has been decreasing by using creativity flower pots flower vessel vases etc are prepared and used to decorate the house many improvement have been taken place in the method of pot so making also right so uh, before the people used to cook in a mud pot now we it's it's totally reducing right so but still people using for the decorative things right so we learn that only right so we improved in many things right so from uh, what from small nothing to something right so we have used those articles also right so now the facilities which is improved right we have to use it in a proper way right so uh, we should use it in a proper way that only about today's chapter okay so you have to write or try these some of the activities given in your textbook okay so thank you for watching kids have a great day